Welcome back to Sorosis. Today I'm going to be giving you guys a tutorial on Sorare. If you like this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. If you're not signed up to Sorare yet, sign up using the link below. You will get a free limited card and you'll get to draft your fantasy football teams. Follow me on Twitter and Facebook and check out my website, Sorosis.com. Okay, let's get stuck into today's content. So today I'm going to be giving you a brief overview of what Sorare is. Tell you everything you need to know so you can get started today on your Surrey fantasy football journey. So if you like fantasy football, football manager and football in general, then you're in the right place. And you're about to learn about the wonderful world of Surrey. But what is it exactly? Surrey is a global fantasy football game where you can compete in tournaments twice a week for free. And you'll have the chance to win big rewards in the form of Ethereum play cards. But not only that, you can also trade cards and collect them if that takes your fancy. NBA and MLB is also now available to play on So Rare. So Rare, one of the first NFT fans football games, incorporate fans football and player cards into one platform. Using the modern technology of blockchain and NFTs to power the global fans football game, you can build a collection of player cards that you'll be able to use in twice weekly fans tournaments that are also free to play. Because these player cards are on the blockchain and an NFT, this means that these cards are digital assets and unique in their own way. So if you like the sound of this and can't wait to learn more, then keep watching. Surrey cards are of course the cards that you can purchase on Surrey of your favourite football players. Player cards come in different rarities and when purchased are processed through the blockchain. Due to this, they are unique and digital property that you own known as NFTs, which stands for non-fungible tokens. The four main card types are limited, rares, super rares and uniques. For the limited, there are 1,000 copies of each player for each season, 1,000 copies of each player for each season in the rare category. Super rares have 10 copies of each player each season and are more powerful and collectible due to this. And uniques are just that, unique, and there's only one unique card of each player for each season, and these cards are the most powerful and expensive cards to hold, and hold the biggest collector appeal. The yellow cards are the limited, the reds are the rares, Blue coloured cards are the super rares and the unique cards are usually found in this black colour that's displayed here by Gabriel Martinelli's 2022-2023 season card. Another important aspect of Surrey of course is buying some Surrey player cards so that you can start to build a lineup to compete for prizes in the Surrey Fantasy Tournaments. You can of course draft your teams for free as well including your Premier League team. You can draft a team for completely free and enter the free to play tournaments. If you want to try your hand at the tournaments before obviously buying some of the cards you can play for free as well. But if, when you are ready to make that step up to the bigger leagues you can buy player cards via the auction market known as the primary market and this is where new cards are added onto the platform by Surrey themselves. This works a bit like an eBay auction where you'd bid on a player and then if you're the highest bidder when the auction finalises you will be the proud owner of that card. There's also the manager sales section as well known as the secondary market and this is where you can do some wheeling and dealing with other Surrey managers and you will find listed player cards by other managers here where you can choose to purchase the displayed price or even make an offer at a price that suits you. Whether the selling manager agrees to that price is another matter of course. You can also sell cards of course on Surrey if you do wish to do so. You can set the price and the amount that you wish to sell for. This card will then be listed for 48 hours. If they don't sell, you can always choose to relist. And listing your cards is fairly easy. You just need to go to your gallery, click on the player card, and then you will see a list my card button. You then set a price and confirm the listing of that player. So now you've got some cards and you've drafted your teams, you can now start entering some of the so rare fantasy tournaments. These tournaments are known as SO5 because you have to pick a team of 5 players to enter each eligible tournament. To enter these tournaments you will need at least 1 goalkeeper, 1 defender, 1 midfielder, 1 forward and either an extra defender, midfielder or forward. So a team of 5. You will also need to select a captain who will get a 20% bonus on their score in most competitions. These tournaments are usually twice weekly if there's enough eligible matches. You also need to submit your lineup before the deadline. And there's also different divisions and different criteria for each division and region. Tournaments have different entry requirements and skill levels as well. Some tournaments levels include amateur, semi-pro competitions and pro competitions as well as some capped mode competitions as well. Which requires a bit more tactical thinking. So tournaments to suit all levels. So in the fantasy tournaments on so rare you can win more player cards. 
so rare coins and also ethereum prizes as well which vary for each division you could also win special prizes like match tickets etc and match jerseys from time to time so rare announced the prizes and the amount of eth and card up for grabs for every game week and every division when the game week is open to enter. The amount of available rewards depends on the number of licensed professional players playing in the game week and will therefore vary. At the beginning of the season, Sora reserve a certain number of cards per player and rarity to each league in which the player is eligible. There are six tiers of rewards, with star being the best caliber of reward, and this card reward will win you a star player within that specific region. Second best is tier one, followed by tier two, then tier three, tier four, and tier five. You can also win so rare coins in all competitions depending on how many points you score. You can use these coins to buy badges, skins and boosts for your club and also purchase a mystery football jersey as well from your favourite football teams. So to enter these fancy tournaments you'll also need to know about the scoring matrix that so rare uses. And the scoring matrix used on so rare is based on real world actions that the player performs during a match just like regular fantasy football so the overall player score then so the so rare player score are calculated based on real life performances of players during a game the so rare player score ranges from 0 to 100 and this player score is made up by adding together the player's decisive score and their all-round score the decisive score total statistics that have direct impact on a game things like goals assists red cards the main fantasy actions. The all round score totals statistics during a game that are less obvious to track but are valuable when evaluating a player's overall performance and impact on a game. This can include things like the number of passes a player makes, attempted assists, tackles, interceptions, shots on target, things like that. The maximum score a player can achieve is 100. The minimum score is zero. If a player has two games in one game week, only one game will be counted for the scoring. So that is it. That is a brief overview of what so Rare is all about. Essentially, it's a fantasy football game and sports fantasy game as well, including the MLB and NBA. And you can get started today and start entering these tournaments for free. You can also draft your team as well, including your Premier League team, for free to enter the free-to-play tournaments. And you can get started today and claim your free card you can do that by using the link in the description below this is the best link out there other affiliates have this link as well of course but using my link really helps support my content and as well say thank you for this video so what are you waiting for get started today on your survey journey sign up for free enter the tournaments and then maybe do some wheeling and dealing in the marketplace so that is it you know everything you need to know the basics anyway about what Sora is. So now you can go ahead and start your Sora journey. If you want more information though, do visit my website www.soraresist.com for more articles and free content on there. You can also download a free Ultimate Guide to Sora ebook as well. Link for that is in the description below. You can download that for free today. Okay guys, thanks for watching. If you did like this video, smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. As I say, if you're not signed up, use the link in the description below. Really appreciate that. And check me out on Facebook and Twitter by searching at Assist. And thanks for watching as always. And I'll see you again on the next video.